In the fleet to reduce radio transmissions, uncalled turns are virtually SOP. They require alertness on the part of the wingman. A wing rock indicates the direction of the turn. The underside of the leader's aircraft shows a turn away from the wingman is to be made. The top of the wings shows a turn into the wingman. Turns by the leader will not always be level 30 degree angle of bank turns and may be for more or less than 90 degrees change of direction. Turn procedures follow the call turn methods. If turns continue past 90 degrees, the procedures reverse for each 90 degree increment. When a wingman passes behind or below the lead, he must have an airspeed advantage. If the lead rolls out early, this energy advantage will help the wingman regain his correct position. If unsure of the direction of the turn, the wingman should always assume a turn away. If the turn is into, closure is rapid and easily detected. Recovery is accomplished by reversing and continuing with turn into technique. If the turn was away and the wingman proceeded as for a turn into, separation would increase rapidly. Upon recognition of the lead's turn away, the wingman will have to sacrifice excessive altitude to regain position. Radio transmissions are minimal except for tactical transmissions. Whenever in combat spread, the wingman must be prepared to go into loose-deuce maneuvering. 